Hello everybody, Steve Trigian with another Peglin run. And today we're gonna use three boss relics. Uh, Matryoshka shell plus Electro Pegna to move around and the Crisp Mask just to um, fix the DPS problem that Matryoshka shell provides. I've done this run already two times without the Crisp Mask and uh, yeah, it, 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 it doesn't work. It doesn't work. It's uh, at some point you just lose. I mean, you can obviously be lucky and when I say it doesn't work, I don't mean that it literally does not work at all. That's not what I say. Obviously, you can make it work. But um, trust me when I say that uh, with one unlucky room that's not in a good layout or with one unlucky hit, you literally lose the fight. So uh, I'm just gonna just get my damage boost up and uh, continue this onwards. Let's go. As you see, this is almost normal DPS happening. Other than the fact that, um, yeah, I mean, you just pop the bombs and that's it with this area. Let's continue. Easy win. Upgrade an orb, obviously. Crit orb. Oh, we got like three elites here, but this one has a relic with it. And there's another relic down here. And there's triple relic. What is this whole road, man? Yeah, let's go this area. Left, left, left. And then over here. Wait, this stays? This is stupid. Why does this stay? Are you kidding me right now? Why does this stay? Why does the confusion stay? Boo. Boo. I'm thoroughly... I disagree. Let's go. Maybe hit a crit. Maybe hit a bomb. Look at this. Magnetism. Nope. Magnetism not even doing what it's supposed to do. But we got a kill, so the crit would not matter at all. Get a crit. Off we go with damage. We got two bombs. Nice waste of bombs there. Classic. And uh, yeah, let's continue. I mean, uh, let's continue. Oh, wow, did you see that? Phew. That was a good corner. And we wasted three bombs, not only two. At least we did some damage to the upcoming enemy. That was the worst possible thing I could have done. But now the confusion has run out. And uh, nothing has really changed. I still uh, hit the... Missed the, gr the crit with the reset with Grace. As that's what my Orb does. Let's go with even higher crit orb here. Uh, I mean, we will go left. So left. No, I forgot that I have the magnetism for half a second there. But uh, in the end, we actually went where we wanted to. Crazy that that's possible. <laughs> okay, I don't see us hitting a crit, so let's just throw this down the hatch. Hope it doesn't hit a bomb, at least not this early. Nice 56 damage. Can I get an easy crit? No, not really, so we're throwing this away. Let's go in the middle again. Maybe now I could hit some bombs. Whoop. Whoop. Nope. Whoop. Magnetism. Oh, good reset there on the, on the way down. Good reset, I have to say. But this was a big fail, as now the good reset actually made it so that I'm not gonna go in there again. Let's try again. Whoop, got one bomb. Now I need 3D damage, not get damaged next turn. Actually, I need the second bomb, otherwise I will get damaged. Yep, I will get damaged, and you know why? Because of the mechanic that says you get hit when you reroll your deck. Like every single other roguelike card game or whatever that has... The deck running out you lose your life randomly right right i'm gonna continue being salty about that <laughs> not salty i'm not salty let's go here let's hit and now the next one is definitely going to be a kill you know what let's go with a crit i don't think we're gonna get the damage that we were getting yesterday yesterday's damage was insane yeah this is definitely not as fun as yesterday was but uh still it is uh it's something to be seen great norb I mean, stone. Stone it is. Stone it is. Continue to the left side. Almost made a mistake again because of the Electro Pagnet. Electro Pagnet. Wrist Mask and Montrush Shell. Okay, let's go with the tier 2 bar there. Instant reach. Whoa, that was nice there. And that was not nice. Maybe hit two bombs. Maybe go down the hatch. That's also choice. Oh, I hit a bomb. When did that happen? This guy is going to hit us. Did not. Let's go over to that side. Maybe. I mean. I guess. Uh, pachinko way, man. Pachinko way. Although this is not the pachinko way. This is literally the electro pegnet. So. Doesn't count. Whatever. Whoop. Maybe a bomb. Nope. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Yeah, we got a bomb. Nice. How did that bomb pop instantly? I don't remember it being lit. This bomb is lit, man. <laughs> 
Let's go for maybe a reset. Nice. Vroom vroom with a... Yeah, I'm still doing a bunch of damage. Not 3,000, but not 2,000, but still 300 is pretty decent. Ooh, Darkness a Turbo. I think I'm going to go with a Memor Ball. Memor... Memor Ball. <laughs> okay, Sift, whatever you say. Let's go over there for the Relic on the left of the Elite. If this Elite was here, I would go for the Double Elite. Let's get a good Minotaur. Nope, we got the Slimes, which is really nice for us. Reroll this, obviously. Oh, up, got a crit. Very nice. It should be easy enough. Yeah. Can I get at least all three bombs instead of only two of them? Because two of them is really bad. Okay, game. As you wish. <laughs> Let's go into the reset. We got the last bomb. Well, at least we got the last bomb. So, nope. So now I just needed another 70 damage, is what I was about to say, but nope. Nope, it is. Let's go for the crits. Otherwise, I just need 20 damage, which should be easy-ish. We got the crit, so we're up to 247. Okay, let's get the crit here, which uh, can do like 50. Man, the reset there is extremely bad. Positioned. Okay, I will try to get the reset open. It's not open per se, but... Okay, it's, it's opening up. It's opening. I'm gonna reset this again. Let's go into a crit first, and uh, the reset sec... I should stop doing that. I'm doing this so often. Like, I'm gonna go for the reset, the crit, and then the reset. Yes! Hit another crit on your way down. Hey, magnetism doesn't work anymore. No! Why doesn't magnetism... Why did magnetism not work there at the very end? Let's fling this in there and hope it hits the crit. I knew that the magnetism was gonna screw with us. Yeah, nice, 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 nice. Maybe a bit more. Nope. Seems like magnetism doesn't always work. And we get hit twice for 14. Uh, 45 damage, so with some amounts of hits here, we should be winning. A bit more, a bit more, a bit more. Nope, down the hatch. And magnetism got deactivated again, but we win. Upgrade Norb. Upgrade this. Overkill damage. Obviously, we go with overkill damage with what we're doing. Let's go over there. Let's get a relic. Imagine having yesterday overkill damage. Imagine. The most useless relic in the game. I'm not gonna go for the bombs. Not without the thing that hits everything on its path. Okay. I mean, uh, yeah, let's go. You don't hit the bomb, that's the only thing you, I need you to not do. It doesn't matter, I'm definitely gonna be doing it a million damage every round. So right now, magnetism is still working. <laughs> if it is not parent. I don't know what makes it so that magnetism does not work. Reroll this. Hit the crit. How did I miss that? That was such a bad play from me. I didn't even hit the real crit. Uh, I didn't even hit the reset. Try to somehow send balls off to the left. Maybe hit the reset. I mean, I got a kill at least. And uh, with overkill damage, I will kill this one. Uh, hit the, uh, the back line too. Yeah, very nice. Okay, I'm gonna go for the crit. Well, well, well. If it isn't bugs again. Oh. <laughs> okay, I mean, I can't go for the crit, but I need to go for the reset. Even with the stupid orb. Come on. No, come on. Come on, man. No. Ah, uh, magnetism. You see, that's why I lost, by the way, the other two runs I was saying to you. Because magnetism is not trustworthy. You see this? You you can't trust anything with magnetism. Throw this away. Did like this. It's gonna fling upwards. Oh come on, I can't hit the reset. It's gonna fly top. Yes! Oof. I'm okay with getting hit twice. I hate that the melee enemies. Okay, I had a lot of things, okay? I, 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 I really... I, I'm getting frustrated with these things. I mean, why 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 do the backline attack? Is, is it so bad that we cannot... Is it... Do we really need to get hit like a thousand times every time? Is it really so bad? Would it be so bad if... Um, I should definitely have changed orbs there. Would it be so bad if we didn't lose life and we reset our... Um, when we literally just change a card? Would it be so bad? I don't think it would be so bad. I think we're gonna hit the crit. 
Yeah. That's why that's why I threw away that thing. So the crit up here. This time I'm pretty sure we will hit the crit though. Didn't hit the reset, but still one. Nice. Easy enough. Mm, let's go with the icicle. Uh, I want to go left. No, I want to go right. I want with the relics. What are we talking about? Let's go here. It will hit this. Give us a life. <laughs> Such a good relic. Super boots. Give us one life. <laughs> it's the worst relic in the game. <laughs> uh, let's uh, let's maybe hit the crit. Maybe. I said maybe, you know. I hit a bomb though. I hit the crit too. Can I maybe not pop all the bombs? Uh, change of plans now. No, no, no. Stop hitting bombs. Stop hitting bombs. Thank you. This is the map I lost, by the way. <laughs> the first time I did this, I popped every single bomb and I died. I, I was not able to kill the other four enemies. Let's continue. Because I didn't have the cursed mask, by the way. Imagine this map without the cursed map. You literally popped the bomb, which just happened, but now I popped the bombs and I won. But can you imagine this map without the cursed map, uh, cursed mask? You you pop all the bombs, turn one, because the Matroshka uh, actually does that. And then you literally lose. Like, literally, you can't, you can't do anything at all. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Ah, <laughs> uh, Pachinko way, man. Pachinko way. They're Pachinko way, as always. You gotta... Yeah, of course, the events are fight. Of course, half the events are fights. Let's go wherever. Doesn't really matter, even if you hit the crit or not. I, I just need you to do 80 damage, man. Okay, it's enough. Everything's dead. You can go upwards there. How many, how many times is this going to happen? Whoop, again over there. Whoop, over there. Whoop. <laughs> Let's go. 260 damage. Spinny, spinny. Got the reset. Very nice. Now I just need to do 60 damage. Nope. Change of targets. Let's go over there for the reset. Down the hatch, turn one. And down the hatch, turn two. Okay. Let's go for a round around. Nope. I I was hoping it would go round around, but Magnet completely broke it. Okay. Let's go with round around here. As this is electricity, so wow, it hit it hit reset and went down the hatch. Hit the bomb, please. Thank you. Hit the other bomb too. Nice, 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 nice. Everything's dead. Electric. Mmm, Splat Orb applies Rubber Slam to every five hits. Rubber Slam are bouncy and can be hit three times in one shot before they are popped. I mean, I need life. Okay, can I hit that one though? How so? I got a relic out of this. Nice, nice, nice. <laughs> um, another relic there. You are immune to damage while building. Thank you. This should be the default, by the way. Well. Pachinko way! Pachinko way! And I, I even uh, try to be a bit far away while targeting that. Okay, resets, contribute to damage. Really unimportant buff here, really unimportant. Let's see what we get. And this is a map we all have come to love from the last run. Can I get a crit out of this? Nice. Can I get not a single bomb out of this? Not nice. Can I get at least one more bomb? No. So I wasted the bomb just now. Okay, at least it's an icicle. Hit the crit. That's enough. That's enough. Okay, hit every bomb, please. Don't only hit one bomb. Stop doing that. Stop hitting one bomb. Oh, it's two bombs. Okay, that, that's okay. That's okay. Two bombs I'm okay with. 144. By the way, does this say pierces or damages? Well, I can't see it. Can I? Can I? I. Critical hit pierces through enemies. Ah, pierces. Okay, not damages. Got it. Let's target the backline, by the way. I've been told if you target the backline, maybe I should crit. Let's go for the crit. It's not gonna hit the crit. I don't feel it. I don't feel it hitting the crit. Uh, I mean, I say I don't feel it as if it's like reality, but obviously it's up. I feel it now. <laughs> Whoop. Now, this should pierce correctly, right? I've been told to, when you have piercing, you should... Yeah, this pierces correctly now. Okay, that's what I've been told. And as you see, when you follow advice, it actually works out. 
So um, it seems like piercing is uh, what's it called? Like hitbox based. So if you wanna hit, make sure that it's gonna pierce the back line, then you have to target the back line so it will hit the front line, but will try to pierce through to the back line. Really stupid uh, mechanic, I know, but it is what it is. Let's go for a crit heal here and be done with the heal. Okay, we're super full life. Where's the reset, by the way? I think I just threw away like a bunch of damage. Well, it doesn't matter. Well, at least we're fully healed, you know? And also, at least we threw a bomb away. 110 health. Let's go over there. We got an icicle. Now, I would like to hit the reset when it was down there, but it didn't. It hit it now, which is decent, which is decent. At least we got the hidden and pierce everybody. Ding, ding, ding. Very nice. I love the icicle. The icicle is awesome. Let's go here for a crit. Maybe hit the reset before you go down. No. Really disappointed. Could have done a 200 damage if I hit this reset. And I'm just gonna do 141. Might have even killed the enemy. Now I got my real targeting back, so let's go reset. Hit the bomb there. Hit the crit. Nice. Would have should have gone with the dagger. Now let's not forget that I have piercing, so this will hit this, kill it, and hit the tree. Even better. Nice. Tree is almost dead. Oh, nice crit. Nice crit. Will we will we pierce the tree? No. No, no, no. Will we pierce the tree and kill the boss? No. How many have I hit yet? 99 damage plus. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna go here. I mean, are you kidding me right now? How did I miss everything? It's okay. It's fair enough. It's fair enough. It's fair enough. Boss is dead. 111 damage plus. Yeah, a boss has 111 life. I had exactly as much life as the boss had in lethal. So it's gonna say 179, but I think it's gonna do more than 179. 196, yeah, I knew it. So how this works is, um, first, it adds the damage, and you can see the damage on your peg hits, but then at the very end, it also adds the damage from the peg hits that this thing did onto this number, and then it does the damage to the enemy. So that's pretty much it for this. And uh, I think we're done with the... This was obviously a very easy run. I don't disagree with that. I, I don't lie. I, I can't lie. But um, trust me, Electro Pagnet plus only Matroshka was abysmally... Uh, 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 very bad. I don't know how to say it. It was... The, the moment you got into a match that had bombs in it for the clearing condition and you didn't... And you hit the bo bombs turn one, you instantly lost. Like, instantly I had 100 life and I wasn't able to do 300 damage at the moment I got rid of all the bombs on the field. So the enemies were two, uh, one bat and two slimes of 120 life and I died. I, I wasn't able to kill all of them in time. Uh, so yeah, I was taking 11 damage per turn by the way, which is also pretty bad because if you have an enemy a flying bat, a bat and two slimes, the front slime does five, the back slime does three and the bat does three. So you take 11 damage per turn and uh, yeah, if you can't do 100 damage per turn, you will be dead in... Actually, 50 damage per turn. If you can't do 50 damage per turn, you will most likely be dead when you hit zero life. Who, who knew? Either way, tomorrow I was thinking about doing the infinite run. Or, 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 or some kind of orb run. That's my, that's my thought. Because I can also make it so that I start with whatever orb I want. And then I can be like, okay, I'm only gonna play with Matroshka orbs today. I start with three Matroshka orbs. And then I press skip on every single other orb. And then I only have three much orbs through the run. And if I found upgrades, then I upgrade them. Otherwise, they stay level one. Or something like that. I could do some things. There are different ideas. And I could also use this here, the overhammer, with something else. I don't know. I, I think tomorrow I'm going to do the infinite. I think I'm going to do the infinite tomorrow. And after that, we will see. We will see. I would like to hear some opinions on what to do and whatnot. I mean, most of the time, people uh, suggest challenges. But maybe somebody wants to see something specific. And uh, you guys also see the, his comment or her comment, obviously, and drop some likes. And if I see like a comment having f three, four, five, six likes, I will most likely try that idea. But uh, don't get stuck up on only challenges. I will also do some challenges if a good one pops in mind or somebody says something that I might like. But I would like to... More, I, I, my mindset right now is to experiment with this game, not to try to... Um, challenge myself and stuff. I want to experiment a bunch so that when a good big patch drops, we have pretty much explored everything and know what's happening. Because, for example, you might not have seen it, but uh, as I said, I already experimented with Matroshka on its own plus Electropagnet. 
And uh, yeah, my experimentation has shown me that it's uh, really trash because, as I said, uh, those th two things together uh, try to pop all the bombs as fast as possible and then uh, you lose a run just because of that. So uh, that's good. And yesterday we tested the Lucky Meteor plus the... Um, plus the what was that? What, what did we test it with? Lucky Meteor plus... Uh, yeah, plus explosive force. No, actually, plus uh, plus gift that keeps on giving. So that was insane yesterday. And today we found something that's a bit worse. And uh, with more experimenting, more things will uh, will appear. And uh, yeah, I think that's going to be it for today. Once again, if you would like to see more of this, dropping a like or a comment will make it so that those videos will appear on your home screen. So uh, doing that helps me alongside you if you want to see more of this, obviously. And yeah, that's going to be it. Thanks for watching. And see you guys around.